In this video we will understand chapter 4 the Mughals 16th to 17th century. Here we will study 1 introduction to the Mughals 2 Mughal ancestry 3 Mughal military campaigns 4 Mughal traditions of succession 5 Mughal relations with other rulers 6 Mansabdars and Jagirdars 7 Zabd and Zamindars 8. Mughal marriages with Rajput 9. Zat ranking 10. Akbar Nama and Ain I Akbari 11. Noor Jahan's influence 12. Sul I Kul 13. Mughal Empire in the 17th century and after. Let's start. 1. Introduction to the Mughals. The Mughals ruled a vast and culturally diverse region in the Indian subcontinent during the 16th to 17th centuries. Unlike previous rulers, they managed to establish a lasting empire. Expanding from Agra and Delhi to control nearly the entire subcontinent. Their administrative structures and governance ideas had a long-lasting impact. 2. Mughal Ancestry the Mughals descended from two important lineages, Genghis Khan from their mother's side and Timur from their father's side. They preferred their Timurid ancestry due to Tamur's capture of Delhi in 1398 and the negative associations with Genghis Khan. 3. Mughal Military Campaigns Babur, the first Mughal emperor, Initially faced challenges but eventually defeated the Sultan of Delhi and captured Delhi and Agra in 1526, marking the beginning of Mughal rule in India. 4. Mughal Traditions of Succession The Mughals followed copasanary inheritance instead of primogeniture, dividing inheritance among all sons. This was a departure from the eldest son inheriting everything. 5. Mughal relations with other rulers. The Mughals often engaged in campaigns against rulers who resisted their authority but also formed alliances with many, like the Rajput. Through marriages and political appointments, they maintained a balance between defeating and respecting their opponents. 6. Mansabdars and Jagirdars. As the Mughal Empire expanded, they recruited people from various backgrounds and ranks, known as Mansabdars. Mansabdars were assigned a rank, salary, and military responsibilities based on their Zat, numerical value. They received revenue assignments called Jagirs. 7. Zabd and Zamindars The Mughal rulers relied on taxing agricultural produce. They categorized intermediaries including local headmen and chieftains, as zamindars. Akbar introduced the Zabd revenue system, fixing taxes on crops, but this was not feasible in all regions, leading to peasant revolts. 8. Mughal marriages with Rajput Mughal rulers often married Rajput princesses to strengthen political alliances. These marriages played a significant role in cementing relations between the Mughals and the Rajput. 9. Zat Ranking Zat Ranking determined the nobles' positions and salaries in the Mughal court. The higher the Zat, the more prestigious the role and the larger the salary. The number of high-ranking Mansabdars increased over time, potentially increasing state expenditure. 10. Akbar Nama and Ain I Akbari Akbar commissioned Abul Fazl to write a history of his reign, resulting in the Akbar Nama and Ain I Akbari. These texts provide insights into Mughal administration, culture, and statistics about the empire. 11. Noor Jahan's influence Noor Jahan, the wife of Emperor Jahangir, played a significant role in his court and even had coins struck in her name. Her influence was marked by her active participation in governance. 12. Sul I Kul Jahangir followed the policy of Sul I Kul, promoting religious tolerance and allowing people of various faiths to coexist peacefully in his empire. 13. Mughal Empire in the 17th century and after The Mughal Empire prospered economically and commercially, 
but wealth disparities were evident. A small number of high-ranking officials received a significant portion of the empire's revenue, leaving limited resources for peasants and artisans. As Mughal authority declined, regional centers of power emerged, leading to the consolidation of independent political identities in various provinces. So, here we studied. 1. Introduction to the Mughals 2. Mughal ancestry 3. Mughal military campaigns 4. Mughal traditions of succession 5. Mughal relations with other rulers 6. Mansabdars and Jagirdars 7. Zabd and Zamindars 8. Mughal marriages with Rajput 9. Zat ranking 10. Akbar Nama and Ain I Akbari 11. Noor Jahan's influence 12. Sul Aikul and at last 13. Mughal Empire in the 17th century and after. Thank you.